I'd like to study you further. And also assure you that I will be a consummate professional throughout. Welcome to science! Apologies. I'll try to stop doing that. But some habits are harder to break than others. In any case, I haven't had a... Um... Lab partner. Actually, I've never had a lab partner. I had minions. Uh, I mean, assistants. Let's begin. completely normal. Tell me if it starts hurting. Currently, I'm scanning your molecules. And they're... <clears throat> interesting. Remember, you passed out the last time we examined you. We can never forget that we are inside a serious scientific environment. I knew you weren't just good looks. <clears throat> Sorry. We need to take research seriously. Excellent. It's finished scanning. What? What? Don't be. I think your arm is emitting a signal? Super cool. <clears throat> Questions this raises are fascinating. How is your arm emitting GPS coordinates? I didn't expect the machine to show anything. I was just having fun. I mean, being inquisitive and probing, which a researcher must always be, which is why we're following that signal. <clears throat> In order to conduct further analysis. <laughs> the signal led us here? I don't understand. Why an arcade? Molecule warriors? Okay, I have a theory about why we're here. No. There are monsters close by. You know, I've wondered why arcades have made a resurgence. Oh, yeah, no doubt. I mean, it can't just be because arcades are amazing. There must be something deeper. Listen to me. We need to focus. We're here to... Amazing! The developers did absolutely no research for this. Where do I even start? Maybe I can play and educate you at the same time. Oh, you think so? Do you know how I won? Applied science! That's what happens when you stand on the shoulders of giants. You can use them to stomp on your enemies. Um, let's... let's go back. No, research must be taken seriously. Molecule warrior. I 
begun writing a paper on your arm's ability. Exactly. The poster is part of my appendix. Yes, of course. <clears throat> I have a theory about your arm signals. It has to do with your desires. Please be honest while conducting research. You like molecule warriors, correct? <laughs> it's a good game, even though it's riddled with inaccuracies. I just had a thought. Would you be interested in a scientifically accurate molecule warriors? Noted. Enough distractions. Anyway, during our first examination, when I said molecule, that must have reminded you of your beloved game, Molecule Warriors, which your arm must have found and created a signal for you to follow. In other words, your arm has become a compass for stuff you like. I know, you have terrible taste. If we want to unlock your arm's true potential, we need to understand it. In order to do that, we need equipment. So in theory, if we nurture your love for science equipment, your arm should guide us to some. So, how do beakers, funnels, lab burners make you feel? Good, as you should. Lab burners can create the conditions necessary to study everything. It is like the flame of Prometheus himself. With a single lab burner, I could unlock the secrets of these monsters, these walls, and burn them to the ground. Uh, uh, sorry, that was unbecoming of a researcher. I know. Thank you for holding me accountable. Research and experiments must be treated with respect, and they must be taken seriously. I shouldn't be... Never at the expense of safety. We need to find answers, but no knowledge is worth... Never mind. Let's continue. Well, we confirmed my theory. <sighs> Let's hope people have a fetish for science equipment. I learned a lot today, none of which I wanted to know. <sighs> you weren't thinking about scientific equipment, were you? I see. I appreciate your honesty, but... Why couldn't you get excited about the science museum? That place has a surplus of science equipment. Instead, we're here, looking at the next issue of... Tentacles Weekly. Not good enough! We fought monsters to get here. We could have died! I want to discover things, make the world a better place. We need to focus on that and not this. All right, let's make the most out of this. Which part of the store is your arm drawing you to? I'm curious. Huh, I see. Why? Uh, um, of course. Interesting. Let's go home. <laughs> 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 
must have evolved to protect itself. Amazing! We can't let it get away. But how? It's too fast! Watch me. Monster, you are right to fear and run from us. Though you may outrun humans, you will never outrun human ingenuity. Rise, Balsicle! and get on the ballsicle. I sense we left things a bit awkward since last time. Oh, my awkwardness measuring device is working. I built it when I was practicing, I mean, mastering flirting. Anyway, it was showing red last night. So, I just wanted to say, I'm sorry. It's just that research, experiments, they can be a lot of fun. They can change how you see the world, but they can also be dangerous. They can blind you to reality as you focus on the possibilities. Yes, my passion is dangerous. I... My dream was to create a wormhole. I kept on thinking, just a little more, just a little more. I was so focused on the possibilities that I, that I didn't notice I was overloading my machine. If my assistants hadn't turned it off, 527 people would have died. All because I got too excited about science. That's when I vowed I'd lock away my passion. And then I broke that vow and shocked you. It's not. But thanks. Can we continue like we did? I'll be even more careful this time. I see. Why not? You're really nice, but you heard what I almost did. <sighs> I want to be passionate. I'm not sure. Only because you're asking for it. <clears throat> Science must be done. Observations must be noted. Must be tested. Dynamic equilibriums must be achieved. All in the service of human progress. So? Yes! Hey. Thanks. led us to the science museum? I love this place. With this, we shall unlock the mysteries of the universe. Is this really okay? Why wouldn't it be? You've seen it, experienced it. How crazy I can get. I could have hurt so many people. If being cold and calculated keeps people safe, maybe that's a sacrifice worth making. It is! but it is what good has passion ever done for me uh, I guess when you look at it objectively 
That's not a bad thing. isn't that bad I went from one extreme to another trying to hold myself back hasn't been fun that said it's never a mistake to focus on safety I swear in this science museum that I will let passion guide me but not control me thank you it feels good to allow myself to be myself You know, I'm making you something. Well, you'll just have to figure that out later. Huh. I don't feel we've reached the mech part of our relationship. But, okay, I'll give you a hint if you promise we'll play it together. Great, it's a promise then. The hint is... You'll enjoy it. <laughs> Wait, Aurora Borealis? Th that's impossible. Never mind. Quick, get over here. Perfection. I'm keeping this. Hey, we need to talk about our research. Let's go into my room. I finished writing my report on your arm. Unfortunately, we haven't been able to confirm our findings because... <laughs> your arm now just keeps on guiding us to me. Of course I know why it's happening. But worry not. Science is as vast as it is deep. And you and I are competent divers. I can teach you some of them. But keep going. I like it when you say nice things about me. been saving that one, haven't you? I'm going to kiss you now. What do you prefer? Me or science? <laughs> I should have asked if you liked me more than tentacles. On a date? Romance! I'm excited. What do you want to do? I do have a lot of fun stuff in my room. I want to expand my area of study. Now, as you know, Science is all about experimentation. That's fine. I respect that. Awesome. I am going to use my ice powers to lower your body temperature. Not yet. But you will be. My sexy ice cube. Now, let's hook you up to this machine. Good. Yes, let's look at the world. That's 
Ursa Minor. Oh, look! It's the Xanarkand and Spira Star. They are indeed. Enough gazing at stars. I want you to gaze at me. Let's go downstairs. That's science equipment. Don't touch that. Don't be. I like that you're interested. Have architects? I hope not. I don't like it. It feels so limiting. But when I'm with you, I feel limitless. Wow, we are so cheesy. I love it. I was waiting for that. The world will be back to normal soon. And then I'll be able to show you my surprise. I'm sure you'll love it. Maybe. My apologies, but this may hurt a bit. Johan, please start the ritual. is missing! Dude. Sorry we're late. What happened? See ya. She's... Umbra's energy patterns have changed. She's no longer a pure architect. Of course. She merged with a child of Lux. 
Such wasted effort. And for what? What is it exactly that bonds give you? Regret? Self-loathing? Delusion? <laughs> and you think you need that? <laughs> You're wasting your time. Yes. Where did that come from? You shouldn't have come, but thank you. What? What's going on? You can't defeat her because of me, right? I think I know what to do. Isn't it strange how at the heart of a storm, there is always a calm? <laughs> that wouldn't help anything. I can't go. I want to, but... I can bend the laws of this universe. But I can't break them, no matter how hard I try. I know. That's why... I don't want this to be goodbye. We can't stop this. I have to go. that this is happening. I really thought we were going to make it through this. I had so many plans for us. We were going to have so much fun together playing. No! Stop! Playing the game I made for you. Playing the game I made for us. That was the surprise. I made you a game. A game I really wanted to play with you. It's not over! Not yet! I love you. 